Hey everyone, it's Doug McGuff with Ultimate Exercise, Body by Science, and DrMcGuff.com. Uh, today I was recollecting a commercial from probably more than a decade back um, from Secret Women's Deodorant. Uh, the premise of the commercial was that this guy ran out of his deodorant and used his wife's deodorant instead and was really impressed with how well it worked and he really liked it and ended up telling his wife about it and she says, oh, that's uh, women's deodorant, that's secret deodorant. And he became all mortified that he was using women's deodorant and he immediately ran out and did manly things like chopping some wood and mowing the lawn, um, doing burnouts in a sports car and watching a sports game on TV in order to reestablish his manhood after using a, a women's deodorant. And it was a commercial meant to be funny, but buried in that is some truth. Nowadays, uh, particularly in men um, in their 40s, 50s, and 60s, there's a lot of talk about testosterone replacement therapy and a lot of notion amongst people that are involved in training that perhaps TRT might actually help with their workouts or enhance their workouts or make them better. And to some extent that's true, particularly if it can be documented that you do have some sort of deficiency but I do want to let you know that the converse also applies. That um, testosterone is not only a driver of good workouts, good workouts are a driver of testosterone, just like in the commercial. Um, so if someone is doing um, high intensity resistance exercise with a meaningful level of intensity, and you are following a good diet, you're eating steak and eggs, and you're getting out in the sun, and you're getting adequate sleep, and you're also making decisions, doing things where you take control of your existence, all of that actually does significantly drive your testosterone up in a very meaningful way, which then has a feed forward positive effect to your workouts and ends up being a virtual, uh, a virtuous cycle, so to speak. So I did just wanna bring that to you. Um, a lot of people really get anxious about their testosterone and what the level is and whether they should do some sort of replacement therapy. But the first step might actually be to set yourself up to win, to actually do the kind of things that augment and support the best testosterone levels possible. So do high intensity resistance exercise, get out in the sun, eat a good diet with adequate fats, eat steak, eat eggs, have sex, make decisions, take control of your life and watch your testosterone surge. So just a little thought for this week. Now, turn off your phone and go outside and do some dope shit. For Ultimate Exercise, Body by Science and DrMcGuff.com, I'll talk to you the next time.